Hey, Run Junkies, it has been a long time since I have done an unboxing and my Runner's World subscription box ended and I didn't really know what I was gonna do next. And I found a new runner's box called the 5K Crate. Now, this is a quarterly box. It's a little bit more expensive, but there's more in it. Here's what I liked about it and why I signed up for an annual subscription. I will get this seasonally. So this is the spring box. The nice thing about this is that there is a box for men and a box for women, and it is sized. What that means is that there are clothes in here on occasion, and it will be sized for you. I will leave a link in the description below to the 5K Crate link. And why I decided to go with this was uh, I wanted something a little bit more substantial than the Runner's World box. I wasn't happy in the end with how they were coming out with their boxes. They just kind of got a little lazy and I didn't like how they were just trying to fit it in and it didn't quite work for me. So I wanted to try something new. I also wanted a little bit more variety within the box itself. And I like the idea that they do include clothing with it. Each 5K crate box is $69.95 and an annual subscription is about $276. But you know, I'm, I'm done talking about it. Let's just open it up. Okay, so. The 5K crates. This is actually pretty cool. So, all right, before, uh, okay. So there's your card, there's your logo. What's in the spring box? Oh, cheat, I don't wanna, I don't wanna cheat. Okay, first thing is the 5K crate logo head sweat visor. Now, I love these visors. They're actually quite comfortable. I prefer head sweats. Uh, uh, hats to pretty much anything else. The only problem with uh, visors, especially now that I have short hair, is that they kind of make my head look dumb. I mean, my, my hair doesn't like to behave anyway in a visor, that's why I like wearing a hat. When my hair was longer, I would pull it back in a ponytail, but I actually tried wearing a hat the other day, or a visor the other day, and I mean, it just, like my hair, sticks out the top, I don't know. I just think it looks silly. Um, so I'm a little bit vain when it comes to wearing a visor, but this is super comfortable. But yeah, like my hair will, will eventually, as I'm running, will start to fall out of the visor. But that is a nice visor, the visor. Oh, wow! Oh, wow! Okay, now I'm super excited. Guys, guys, they know me. They know me. <laughs> I love these Motivate wraps, obviously. Um, these are starting to wear out quite a bit and I'm probably due, due for some new ones, but they, these are the Momentum Motivate wraps, uh, all day inspiration for your life. The pink one says be awesome today and the black one does not have uh, a, a, a badge on it. So I might just take one of these guys that's kind of old and gross and um, and put it on the black one. So and I'm not a big fan of pink, but I do I do love these Motivate wraps. I mean, obviously you see these. That's cool. But the fact that it says be awesome today, that just makes me super happy. Cause, right? All right, next. This is very cool. Okay, if, I, if this is what I think it is. Moisture wicking non-slip headbands. Yep, greasy girl headbands. Now, does it fit? And do I wear these? Yes, I actually do wear uh, these headbands when I'm doing yoga. That's kind of cool, I like that. When I'm doing yoga or um, uh, weight training weight training or anything like that. So this is super comfortable actually, whether or not it's as non-slip as they say it is, uh, that's a different story entirely, but I do like that. It's also like an, the inner lining is more like a jersey material, so it's vented. And then the outer is um, two pieces, so it's the black and orange stripe. And that's more of a, um, uh, a lycra material. So that's nice too. Socks, I love getting socks. So that, this is Swift Wick socks and these are size large, which who knows what that means. So these are, okay, these are a bit big. Uh, these are a large and they fit women 10 and a half to 12 and a half, that might be okay. Um, so let me open these. These are really super cushy. They're very similar uh, in feel 
two of the Lega sock. They're big, they are definitely big. I think my husband might be able to wear these. These are a bit big for me, but that's okay. Swift wick, I like the color. Kind of boring, a little. Maroon is okay. The The height of the sock comes just over the, the top of the shoe, which would be nice. Um, but that's moisture wicking socks. Okay, next. I love these. Epic Wipes, I got one of these in uh, the Runner's World box. These, in fact, I still haven't used it. This is basically a shower and a bag. So it was one giant wet wipe and you can kind of wipe the dirt and grime and sweat off before, you know, if you don't have access to a shower right away. This is, this is really nice. Now, the last thing in here is a shirt and it has the 5K Crate logo on it. Okay, see that? This is a Henley long sleeve shirt, zip up. Let's see if it fits. Oh. oh that's comfy. That's a real, I love, this is my favorite color, obviously. I mean, favorite color, favorite color, right? So this is obviously uh, my favorite color, but I, I also like the um, the zip up this, I wouldn't, I wouldn't necessarily wear this, uh, come summer. Uh, there's going to be a time now that I won't be wearing this a whole lot, maybe to start off an early morning run and then unlayer it. But, um, this is, this is definitely a, a shoulder season, um, a shoulder season shirt. Now, one thing about shirts like this is that they have the thumb loops but I have freakishly long arms and the thumb loops tend to, you know, dig here. Um, so I don't always wear, uh, I don't always wear, um, use the thumb loops because as, as I'm running like this, it really digs in here and I can feel it kind of digging here. I have, like I said, I have freakishly long arms. I, that's not necessarily an issue with the cut of these, um, of this shirt. It's just how it, personally fits me. Um, but this is nice. Look at that, you guys. That's pretty. Super pretty. But that is everything in the box. So, ta -da. So let me see. What is my favorite item? We have the shirt, the socks, the visor, the headband, the epic wipe, and the motivate wraps. I think these are definitely my favorite um, just because it says be awesome today. It's like, I'm sorry, you just can't, you can't go wrong with that. So that was the major score I think here. Um, having the Motivate Wrap, that's gonna be my favorite. What will I get the most use out of besides that? I will probably wear this, uh, especially once the weather starts to cool off again or on those cool and rainy mornings. Um, this will definitely work. Uh, otherwise, I will probably get a little bit of use out of these. I love these thicker headbands because it does keep all of the hair out of my face and um, like a thinner a thinner headband doesn't do that. But otherwise, um, I think least favorite would be the socks because I don't they, because they don't fit basically. So what do you guys think? What is your favorite item out of the 5K crate? What do you think of the 5K crate? Do you prefer this to the Runner's World box? And if you don't know what those are, go ahead and click on this card right here. It will take you to my entire unboxing playlist so you can check out a few of those as well. But let me know what you think. Leave thoughts, questions, comments, and suggestions in the comment section down below. As always, give me a thumbs up if you like this video and please click right here to subscribe for more great unboxings from this channel. Yes, I'm going to get back into doing some of these. That is it for me today, you guys. Thanks so much for watching. Go find your awesome. Until next time, happy running.